Black Friday. Early Black Friday is the new Black Friday, people. Remember, early Black Friday is the new Black Friday. Target, Walmart, everybody has started their deals on what day? November 17th not November 24th, which is the true date of Black Friday. If you're getting anything from Amazon on Black Friday or on this holiday season, the Amazon is known for and well known for just delivering you package deals. What we're looking for is package deals. So if I'm gonna get a Fire tablet or I'm gonna be getting a Echo Show or a Fire Stick, there might be a deal where I'm gonna get an add-on like a free Blink Mini camera or a light bulb. So here you're gonna get the Echo Pop and that's what the offering is, right? They're giving you, they're offering you an Echo Pop plus a light bulb, plus an accessory. So remember, if you're shopping on Amazon for Black Friday, or you are currently shopping on Amazon, make sure to look for the package deals because you might be getting a bonus product and that could be your secret Santa gift or it just saves you 10 more dollars. Next deal that we want to share with you is that Apple products in 2023, this is the first time we have seen this in about four years. Maybe the last time we saw this was in 2019. If you want an iPad, right? You're like, I want to get a iPad, right? This is the iPad 9th generation. If you want to get an iPad 10th generation, these are on sale. These are on massive sale right now. And that's because Apple actually came out on their conference call and said, well, you know what? We're going to be discounting our iPads and our notebooks. And the best deals on notebooks is gonna be on the M1 chip notebooks because Apple went to the M3 chip, but does that mean the M1 chip is not good? The M1 chip will perform, in my opinion, as someone who has recommended the M1 chip for the last two years, my wife, we have a M2 chip, we have an M1 chip MacBook Pro, and I can't tell the difference. I literally can't tell the difference. I don't know if you'll be able to tell the difference, but you can tell the difference with your bank account. And I expect that we should be looking for a 50 inch 4K TV around $200 for this holiday season. I wanna see it from Amazon. I wanna see it from Insignia because these televisions, they're brighter than before. And at 2023 editions, they actually have better color quality. They have better contrast, they're brighter, they're easy to use. And I just think they're better televisions than what you might've expected three, four years ago. So that money is gonna be well spent. If your question is, my wife really wants the Bose QC45. So the Bose QC45s and Bose came out with the new ones. These are the new Quiet Comfort headphones. It's basically the same product. It's basically the same product. They kind of changed it a little bit, but in terms of the overall drivers and everything, it's pretty much the same product. So if you were like, should I get the new QC headphones or the QC45s? I would go with the QC45s, same fit pretty much the same sound. If you're ever looking for a tablet and you're wondering what is the best deal on a tablet, on any tablet, I don't care if it's Samsung, Apple, whichever tablet you choose, on Black Friday every year, it is the Samsung, no, it is the, no. It is always every Black Friday, it is always the Amazon Fire tablet. Why? Because you will not be able to beat the quality as well as the technology that they put inside of them. And Amazon is actually updating their Fire OS to make it less, or actually, let me rephrase that. They're updating their Fire OS to make it more snappier. Brand new Fire HD 10, the 2023, for just about $80. The 11th generation, you're gonna get that for $75. Now, what do I think you should be looking at? I think the new Fire HD 10 is the way I would go, just because it is has the faster processor. And because of just a small, small incremental changes and just overclocking the processor with better camera, this is gonna be, in my opinion, the better deal. In my personal opinion, I think the Fire HD 7 Kids that you see here is the best tablet for a child. Now I have a, I have a two and a half year old, right? And I he has a Fire HD 8, he barely knows how to use it. But I'll tell you what, this 7, it survived me flights, it survived me the mall, and we have dropped this from moving cars. I mean, not on purpose, but you know, I've dropped it from a moving car and it looks brand new. And that's why I recommend the Fire HD 7 Kids, not just because of the price, not just because if I change the profile, it's still gonna be a Fire tablet and I could just use it for myself. It is because it comes with the worry-free two-year guarantee on the tablet. It comes with the Amazon Kids, which is gonna be like getting a 30 or $40 discount Plus this thing is indestructible or indestructible or invincible or whatever you want to call it. This, this tablet case is probably the most bulletproof case I've ever tried. 
and I test cases for a living. Some of the best deals on the cordless space is going to be on the Dyson V8. The V8 is $299.99. That is the lowest price we've ever seen on it. And even though it comes with less suction power than the V10, the V11, it has the smaller size. It has a easier to open dust cup and it's simple to use. You can also get something like the Dyson V11 here. This is $350, which is a great deal. I mean, historically, Dysons have been known to be too expensive, but right now, for the Dyson V11 to be $350, that's not bad. I mean, this is my Dyson V11, and this is the one that we use. The Shark NV360 Navigator Liftaway, why are we highlighting it? It's $99. Historically, at this price, the Shark Navigator has always been about $119. We saw it at $99.99 on the last Prime Day. They have reestablished this price. There's a Ninja Blender, right? You got the 880, you got the 770s. Those Ninja Blender food processors, I think the Ninja Blender is like $100, right? With the food processor and the two Go Cups, like you see here. Then you have deals from Ninja and Shark on their air fryers, their double ovens, their single ovens, their vacuums, everything, everything. And collectively, if you're going to look at like a Shark or Ninja product, historical fact, historical fact, based on what we've seen the past three years, at the minimum, we should be looking for somewhere between 30 to 40 percent. Because that's the normal discount for a Black Friday or a Prime Day deal from Ninja or Shark period in 2023. So that is our expectation and that is our baseline. Someone who owns pretty much every Bissell product you can imagine. This Bissell Crossway Pet Pro for 200 we have not seen this price in such a long time. I, mean, I can't remember the last time, might have been last year, that I got to recommend it to you. It is on sale right now, 200. You also have things like the Bissell Clean View, not the regular base Clean View. We're talking about the Reach editions. We're talking about the Rewind editions. Those are priced somewhere between 100 and 110, which is going to be 20, 30 percent, actually 30, 35 percent cheaper than their normal price. So that's going to be a good deal because on Bissell, 30 to 35 percent is big. Normally, they are not one of those brands that are just heavily discounting. So that's good. Why are we showing you the guys this? Because the Bissell Little Green Machine is the best price deal for a carpet cleaner on Amazon, for a spot cleaner on Amazon right now. If you have any questions why this makes a good gift, just ask your mom because it works. You might be like, oh, well, my mom has that. Well, guess what? Why other moms and other people love it? Because they have not been able to really make a more cost-effective version of something like this. Two tank system, powerful motor, gets out the stain, $89, looks good, easy to store, easy to clean. That's why this is a good gift idea. There we go. So this is a Chromebook. Let me show you, this is the Asus VivoBook. So what is the difference between the two? Well, one's gonna be operating on Windows and one route runs on Google Chrome. Now, what does that mean? Usually the Chrome editions are less expensive. But what we're seeing is that the Windows editions this holiday season, for the first time, probably this year, I've not really seen this even on Prime Day, they are going to be under $200 for screens that are on over 12 inches or 13 inches. Because we've seen deals where 13 inch screens are less for under 200, sub 200. But finally, this Black Friday, right now, we see deals for things like the Asus VivoBook, like the Acer tablets, Acer notebooks, and from Lenovo that are around 200. So that should be our expectation. Right now on Amazon, you got this Asus, Asus VivoBook Go 15, which is a 15.6 inch screen for $169.99. And collectively, we've only seen this around $200. So you're getting $30 off, which on a product like this is massive, massive, massive. They're basically like, you know what? Take it from us, take it from us. Another hot deal is the Vitamix Explorian Blender, which is going to be $229.95. It comes with a 2 horsepower motor and I use mine every single day. It's going to be $299.95. It's going to have a little bit more power than Explorian, but it's coming with a smaller container at 48 ounces. And we had seen that the 5200 Vitamix was on sale, but I think it sold out already. Another great home deal we want to highlight is the Tinoco Floor 1 S5. It is $329.99 and it comes with the iLoop Smart Sensor. And if you're looking for one of the best wet dry vacuums out there that can handle almost anything you have on your floor while being light, while coming with a two year warranty, while having easy to access components, well, I think the Tinoco might be the right one for you. We have tried a lot of these wet dry vacuums out and it is going to be one of the most high tech but value versions you can get and it runs quiet, easy to clean and I enjoy using mine.
The best deal from Blink this year will be the invitation only deal. If you want to get request the invite, $62.99. That's the best invitation only deal right now on Amazon. You're not going to beat it. You're not going to beat it. That's why, because if you're trying to figure out what's the baseline for Blink this holiday season, two for $32.99. That means one, we will not see it for 30 bucks. It just can't happen. Otherwise you just buy two of those and who cares about the invitation only deal. One of the gift ideas that I always recommend to people is getting a tumbler. So Stanley, Yeti, Owala, and Hydro Flask. Those are the big four. I think we're gonna see some great deals on them, but because they you basically are solid, you know, stainless steel, material costs are there. I don't think we're going to see more than about 30% on the Yetis and the Stanleys, which are going to be on things like your SanDisk, your Samsung 980s, and your 990. 990 Pro, you get a 4 terabyte 990 Pro for like 250 right now. That is wild. That is the same price I paid for 2 terabytes 18 months ago. So you get double the memory for the same price I paid 18 months ago. You got the cards, all of this memory, all of these gaming peripherals, all of them, the best time to buy is going to be Black Friday this year, without a doubt. Don't think that you're going to be like, oh, after Christmas is going to be cheaper. No, I don't think so this year. I think these are really the best prices of the season. This is why everyone's preparing for Black Friday. This is why Black Friday started really November 17th, not November 24th. So be prepared now that you have all the information at least to what to expect i hope you're going to find and make this the best black friday of your life save as much money as possible get exactly what everyone wants and then you can relax kick your feet up and just have a wonderful beautiful and restful holiday season and with that thanks for watching if you have any questions please leave them in the comment box below we will get back to you and please hit that like and subscribe button it really does help support our channel and i hope you have a wonderful black friday because let's get to it this is David with the French Flow signing off. Bye, bye, bye.